This Remark Office OMR 2014 video demonstrates how to use image regions as placeholders for adding descriptive data on the fly during form processing. The Prompt for Fill feature uses an image region to hold space in the dataset so that when you process forms, you can enter a description for the batch of forms being recognized. For example, if you process conference evaluations, you can enter the name of each session so that it is tied to the process data. This feature is great for things like conference, session, training, and course evaluations, and the like. Let's take a look at how it works. This is the Remark Office OMR template editor. We are going to be using a forum or conference evaluation form to demonstrate this feature. Many times you have session evaluations when you're at a conference where you use the same form for every session but when it comes to analyzing the data, you want to be able to look at the sessions individually to make comparisons. A great way to do that is to put an image region on your form and then use our fill options to capture that session name when we process the forms. Let's take a look. So we've set up our, our image region called session. I'm going to double click to look at the properties. So it's a data entry region, but I don't want to sit there and hand type the session for every form that I process. So the way to get around that is to turn on the checkbox that says prompt me for the fill value when reading. That way, when I initiate the processing in Remark Office OMR Data Center, I can type in the fill value for every batch of forms that I scan. Let's take a look. This is the data center, and I have that same form open here. So I'm going to go ahead and read some session evaluations. I click the Read button. I've already scanned my form, so I'm going to read images. Click Next, and let's find all my images. What I did was create three session folders just called A, B, and C for demonstration purposes, and each session's images are within the folder. So let's start with the A folder, and here are my evaluations. I'll click Read. So now I'm prompted to enter a value for this particular session. Let's just call it Session A and click OK. The forms are read. Now I have another stack of forms from another session we'll call B. So I click Read again. I'm going to go to the B folder and grab my images. Click Read. And you can see it pre-filled from the last value. I'm just going to change the A to a B because this is my next session and click OK. Now those forms were read. And we'll do it one more time to have a third session, which I just called C. So let's add those forms. And this time, we'll change the default fill value to C and click OK. So now, in our data set, we have three different sessions set of data. We can analyze everything together so we can get an overall picture. We can also break this down now by session quite easily. So let's go ahead and do a quick survey to get into Remark Quick Stats. And I'll show you one report that would be great to look at a breakdown of the data. So on the left task pane is all of our reports, and we'll click Survey and Item Statistics Reports. And I'm going to do a comparative item report. And what that does is allow me to filter the data on a particular uh, piece of information from my data set. In my case, I want to filter the data by session. So I'm going to choose session here. I'm just going to double click and click Run Report. So now I can see, because I entered those names for every session, I can see a breakdown of every question for each session A, B, and C. So if you need a quick way to scan multiple forms all at once, but look at a breakdown of the data by a particular piece of criteria from your form, Try using the new Prompt Me option in Remark Office OMR 2014. Thank you for watching this Remark video. For more information, please use the information on the screen to contact us. And don't forget to check out more of our great videos on our website and YouTube channel.